if a person wants to enter into merchant navy right what are the various pre c courses that the person can do um, for 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 that entry yes this is a very good uh, question and uh, need of the hour uh, and people are not aware where these courses are there and what are the courses in fact i know people are running consultancy agencies just to tell people and get money which are the courses available so then there you will also see a list if you can go to this link and click on this link you will see list of courses where pre c and post c courses are there pre c courses are those courses which you do before joining ship and then go to ship and for maintaining your continued proficiency for getting rank up getting promotion you have to do certain courses those courses are called as post c courses which you come back from c and you do these courses so these courses are also listed in the dg shipping website right so these are the links very important links please get through these links and find out which are the dg approved courses so let's go a quick look on the pre c courses so if you see there are uh, gp rating courses a list of uh, these these uh, courses are available in dg website the link is also available as i showed you in the earlier link if you click on this link you will get to know the uh, courses which are available and in these courses i am just concentrating on the pre c courses where you can plan your career i'm not going about post sea courses which obviously seafarer will come to know once you sail on ships which all courses you need to do there is a pre sea course which is called gp rating course and this gp rating this list is updated and for checking whether the institute is approved or not you have to refer to the dg website because there are few institutes from which they have been already suspended you know so dg continuously monitors them and if they are not meeting the required standards they are suspended you know so there has been a continuous monitoring so please don't go by this list you know this has been showed to you only related to the course what is the course what is the duration of the course what is the minimum education qualification requirement and what are the age requirement for the approval of the Uh, institutes please refer to the dg shipping website link where i have shown the link this is the link you click on this link and then refer to the link and see whether the institute maritime training institute is approved or not so this is a warning again please don't go by the list of the institutes this may be not updated in this list okay then there is a 6 months a catering course which is for saloon ratings if you can see saloon ratings saloon means in galley so there is a 6 months catering course certificate course in maritime catering so this course is also there where the requirements are given the list of colleges running this is also given then there is a orientation course for catering personnel the requirement is given the age requirement is given and the institutes running these courses are given again a piece of warning please refer to the website in dg shipping whether these institutes approval are still valid or not before you venture into doing these courses that's about rating now about deck officers there is a course called pre c diploma in nautical science leading to bsc nautical science so diploma in nautical science is popularly known as a dns course diploma in nautical science these are the minimum education qualification requirement and the age requirement and the list of institutes conducting these courses then there is a course 3 years bsc degree in nautical science age requirement 4 years bsc nautical technology course requirement and age requirement then for engineers there is a 4 years degree course in maritime engineering the requirement marine marine engineering requirement is given the age limit is also given list of courses list of institutes conducting is also given then there is a one year marine engineering course which is called gme graduate marine engineering course the list of their uh, 
medical uh, minimum education qualification and maximum age limit is also given then there is a two years marine engineering course for diploma then there is called a alternate training scheme two and a half years course these courses are also available for engineers for engineer officers then there is a course for ETO electrician and electro technical officers which is a requirement of uh, 85 days course these are the minimum requirements which is given and the age requirement and the institutes conducting these courses so now you know which are the courses what are the career options and which are the courses you need to do